50,000 souls, time to get some levels. Sweet. Uh, Kino was fantastic and so was Lane. But if you had to pick one of the over, you'd pick Kino. It's pretty good. Yeah. I'm a fan. I want to watch, uh, Serial Experiments Lane again, actually. I like rewatching shit. I didn't used to do it, but I realized that, like, rewatching shit, you get a lot more out of it. Uh, you went to a convention once. It was the first anime convention ever in your city. It was great. Everyone was super nice. Had a comfy atmosphere. Tons of people. Didn't know your city had that many weebs. Oh, interesting. I've never heard anyone have a good experience with an anime convention. Not that I've heard a lot of stories, I guess. I don't really know anyone who... I've got, like, maybe one friend. No. Well, Dylan. I've talked about Dylan before. He watches a lot of anime, but he has shit taste. He just watches whatever's popular. You know, he's the guy who watched, uh... I'm not saying any of these are bad shows, but, like, he watched... Um... Attack on Titan. One Punch Man. Uh... Now he's watching Boku no Hero Academia. And I've watched a bit of that. But it's, um... You know, the only reason he's watching is because it's, it's, it's popular right now. Let's get some stamina and up our adaptability more. Yeah. And I've got, like, one other friend who actually watches a lot more of that, but not much. Lane is pretty rewatchable since it's only four hours long. I didn't even think about that. All the pleb filter anime. Yeah, exactly. I don't know, but but personally, I when when there's a medium that I don't consume a lot of, or even if I'm just getting into it, or you know, like music. You know, I'm starting to listen. To, if I'm a while ago, I was starting to listen to, to music more seriously, getting to listen to some of the greats. I don't start out with like, okay, let's, get, let's start listening to albums recently. Let's check out the new hit release. From, uh, you know, whoever the fuck. No, I'm, I'm, I look up like, okay, let's listen to some Radiohead. Let's listen to some Bjork. Let's listen to, uh... Well, King Gizzard and the Lizard Wizard is more newer, but still, like, they're, they're great. We still have 10,000 souls, but not enough to level up? You know what I mean? I don't go for whatever the newest thing is, but that seems to be what he does. He's like, okay, I want to get into anime. Let's watch Attack on Titan. Let's watch Boku no Hero Academia. It's like, alright, I guess. You'll have something to talk about, at least, I suppose. Finally, we can upgrade this. That'll be nice. 300 damage on this fucker. Plus 112. Yes! Um, by the way, does anyone know where we go next? <laughs> I don't really know where we're supposed to go after this. I guess I'll have to take a look around in a second. Let's buy some, uh, life gems. We used quite a bit. A little embarrassing, but... Uh, we'll buy a bunch of regulars. Wait, I already have 32? Excuse me? Or I can buy 32. Hmm? No, I've got two. Okay. 32 is the most I could buy. Yeah, that must be it. Listen to some Death Grips. I did! I actually finally listened to Death Grips. I listened to, uh... To the first one. Money Store. I fucking actually really like it. I don't know why everybody keeps telling me, like, Oh, uh, you know, they're weird. I don't know if you're gonna... I don't know if you're gonna like them. It was just good. Like, I really like the Money Store. I listened to it once and immediately, like, listened to it again. Like, I like it. And everybody was warning me, like, ah, oh, no, I don't know, man. Like, it's interesting, it's worth a listen, but I don't know if it's good. It's like, no, fuck that. It is, I like it. Let's just buy a ton of these, I guess. Yeah, why not? Nothing beats your recommendations. Well, I think you were recommending Death Grips for a while, so, uh, hey, maybe. Um, we have those branches of yore. I think we've got a couple of them. Uh, where are they? We've got two. I know there's one at that place at, like, the beginning of the game. I guess that's worth a check. Yeah, here. Right? Yeah. We'll check that one. Yeah, I, I really enjoy Death Grips. Also Bjork. <laughs> I really liked... Also Radiohead. There's a lot of... It's kind of funny when you look into, uh... You look at, like, the greats, and you think, like, ah, everybody loves Radiohead, you know? Like, it's probably just some... It's probably okay, but then you listen to it, and it's like, no, it's actually really good. I really, I really like it. Same with Death Grips. Same with, uh... 
This isn't the right way. It's the other way. Same with... Weezer. I didn't know fucking the first two Weezer albums were like masterpieces. Nobody told me that. Like, the Blue Album and Pinkerton are like top tier. And then, you know, then it falls falls off pretty quickly. I hear their new stuff. Some people have said their new stuff is actually decent. I don't know. That's the kind of thing that, like, I'll believe it when I see it. I haven't listened to them yet. There's a path out of Majulia, Majula that you have to take. Okay. That makes sense. What is my area code? I'm not going to tell you my area code. <laughs> it's not, I'm not going to tell you personal information. I know that doesn't narrow it down too much, but I'm... How the as specific as I've been is as specific as I want to be. I think the most I've revealed about my location is that I live in a desert in the southwest. You know, I live in the southwest, which which is a desert basically. That's as far as I want to go. Also, these guys are back. I don't want to be any more specific than that. Except you know generalities, I guess. But search your surroundings. Can you knock down this tree? Oh, a knock down. <laughs> It's 6969 six, gay. You're right, I should have come up with a clever comeback to that one instead of just being honest and saying, uh, no. That guy has a surprising amount of health for someone you can get to, at, like, someone who's at, like, the beginning of the game. I mean, I guess it's unlikely you're gonna have a, uh, your thing this early, but still, huh. I don't like this. <laughs> Let's kill one of these fuckers with the uh, with the bow before we go down. Because there's two of them at least that I should be able to shoot easily. Uh, we don't really have a lot. This might not work so well. Ooh, it works really well. Never mind. Easy peasy. I'm not the biggest fan of the bow, but uh, this is, you know, this is fine. No, we're out of arrows. That was quick. I love it when enemies, you miss an enemy, and then they get closer to where you shot because they're fucking retarded. It's nice. Makes things easier on everybody. Makes things a little quicker. Shit, controlling with a controller. <laughs> you know, this last guy we could prop- well, no, I don't want to fall- like, I could plunge on him, but I'm not sure about that height. I could probably make it. I mean, I think we saw the ring equipped, except we don't. No, actually. I, I took that off, I think. Right? I did, yeah. Oh, wait, there isn't a ladder. Oh, well, yeah. I guess we would have been fine, because I would have had to do this anyway. There we go. What is southwest? You mixed up west and east. You're a retard. So more California, Arizona, Utah. Yeah, California, Arizona, Utah, Nevada, Colorado, New Mexico, that area. Fuck this. I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get my health up before I climb up that ladder, because he's probably gonna get a free shot on me. Here we go. He decided not to? Or he's just really slow? It's interesting. Okay, so this is not the way we're supposed to go, but it, I guess it's just an optional path. That seems surprising in Dark Souls 2. Do, na do all Native Americans live there? There are quite a few, but there are also a lot of Native Americans in the, uh, in the Northwest. Are you not from the U.S.? Oh, no, of course not. Well, obviously. <laughs> Austria. Uh, yeah, a lot of Natives. Uh, it's definitely, for sure. But the Northwest also has a ton, like Alaska. Washington, Oregon, you get a lot of natives up there. But yeah, like, New Mexico's full of natives. Arizona's got the big Navajo uh, uh, reservation. They're all over the place. You live in the Southwest, the nice thing is that means there's casinos everywhere. Um, because gambling isn't legal in the U.S., but Native Americans get to skirt around some laws because we took their land, I guess. Uh, you know, it's I think it's stupid as shit. But um, because of it, there are casinos all around. Because there's Indian land all around. Or land that's owned by an Indian guy, and so they can say, Hey, 
Good enough, right? We'll open up a casino. And you know, that's nice. Eh, if you gamble. I don't really gamble. Well, not in casinos. I gamble on fucking cryptocurrency and shit, but... There's a secret next to the Cyclops next to the lake. Mark. If you're trying to get me to see what you're saying by saying Mark, I'll give you a little- I'll give you a little tip. I ha- it's set up to where if you say... After you kill the Cyclops. Oh, 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 okay, I'll go back. I'll kill these guys first, though. Or die. Yep. Is he just gonna eat me? Is this all? Alright. There's a coffin next to the water. Enter it. Oh, that? Yeah, okay. What was I talking about? Fucking Indian reservations or something? There's something I was gonna say. There's some thought I had I was gonna finish. I don't remember what it was. Gambling. Oh! Yeah, I was just saying. <laughs> I just gamble on crypto and shit, not, not gambling in casinos. Why lose your money like everybody else is losing their money, you know what I mean? At least be creative about it. All these guys come back? I mean, I guess of course they do. That means using a bow here is just stupid. <laughs> nice. These guys look slightly different than they did in the first game. I don't really remember that beak. Maybe I just never noticed it. Could you guys, uh, like, like congregate in the middle? Maybe I shoot one arrow just to get him in the middle and then kill them all? Seems like a good idea. Actually, do I have, like, a, one of those stones you drop that does that? Those colored orbs? Uh, maybe. I don't know if I really want to use that on the off chance it's not that. <laughs> just fucking this. Good job. I guess we can just leave. Oh, never mind. This is fine. What's my last name? Yeah, right, buddy. Weeb man. Don't be so afraid of the big-eyed lizards. Yeah, I know. It's Even in the first game, I was, like, more afraid of them than I probably need to be. Uh, I guess we can just ignore these giant guys. I mean, what's the point? Let's just get in this coffin. See what's up. Oh, it's like one of those, like, Egyptian coffin boats. Except, I mean, you could, it's obviously not Egyptian by the side. The nature of your being has changed. What the hell? Did you just, did you just trick me into a gender bender coffin? What the fuck? Todd Howard is not supposed to be a girl. This ain't, this ain't right. What kind of game are we playing? I'm changing back. I'm sorry, this is Todd Howard. <laughs> That's forced feminization. Don't do this. Somebody's getting off so hard right now to the idea of Todd Howard being forced into a womanly form. If this doesn't switch back, I'm gonna be amused, but like... Okay, good. I gotta play as no girl. Wait, is there something over here? Ah, oh, that looked like an item, but no. I would just fall in the water. You're that one. Oh, jeez. Of course you want me to do that. I see. I see. Is that all that was over here? I used one of those branches of yore just to get to the feminization chamber? I mean, I'm sure it's worth it for some people, but I don't- that doesn't seem to me like a good use of our very limited amounts of branches of yore. Alright, okay. Well, at least we got another. You think this person just switched? Now I have to think that every time I see a woman in this game. You think that's a real woman? I think that's a switcheroonie. Let's go back to Majula and find out where we need to go. Getting tricked into becoming a girl. That is some top-tier doujinshi shit right there. <laughs> no comment. Uh... Yeah, where to now? Where have we not been? Is Oh, right. There was somewhere around here. I think it was down here. We went earlier and there really wasn't anything there. It's probably opened up now. Or we have a key or something. Oh, right, we gotta give that girl that soul. Right. Yeah. 
Is that a shard you here to see light? However, oh, also, sh I didn't know I had a shard. Yeah, all right, cool. That's the right way. Oh, cool. Have you played Skyrim? Uh, if you're asking me, then yeah, I have. Modded it a lot. For free. <laughs> have you paid for Skyrim is what you should ask. Oh, yeah. It's not bad with some mods. I mean, I, I like Oblivion more, and I never... I still haven't played Morrowind. Because when I was a kid, I couldn't get it to run on my computer. But now I have... I mean, I have... How did I miss this from the fucking beginning of the game? Oh, shit. Okay. How are people dying here? This isn't a mimic. I mean, I just checked it. How are you dying? You hit it first. You know what was going on. Uh, uh, what? Are the mimics random? Or what? Mm, okay. Need to go back to the guy with the big blue sword. I don't know. I don't know who that... I don't know who you're referring to. The guy with the big blue sword. Give me an area. I'm not really I'm not sure what you're talking about. Morrowind has the best, Oblivion the comfiest, and Skyrim no atmosphere. Skyrim's got some decent atmosphere if you mod it in. Of course that doesn't count, but... Just for the record. You can, you can mod in some atmosphere and it gets pretty good. Mod in some weather shit. Oh, we've been here. No, we've been here. We've done all of this. This isn't the right way. Right? There's no way. We've been to this forest place. Yeah. It's the first place we went to. Unless there's something at the end of it that we missed. But no, that can't be right. Nah, this isn't it. Unless there's a... Uh, unless there's maybe a side pa path somewhere. With like one of those branches of yore could go through. Not that way. Got it. It does when you make it into a camping survival sim. Yeah, that's kind of what happens. It's it's decently fun when you put it like that. I mean, hey, if anything can make a game good, is mods. Now, if you got if your game needs mods to be good, is it a good game? Not really. No, not really. But hey, don't tell Todd that. Also, by the way, does anyone want to see something cool? Uh, just look at the chat real quick. Just, uh... Except... Fucking Twitch, what are you doing? You see this? Yeah, I got one of these now. As well as this. Pretty fucking neat. I can use that anywhere on Twitch now. I can spam Todd's Howard's face. Pretty great. Unfortunately, though, they're still trying to, uh... Sugoi desne. <laughs> Thanks. They're, uh... Twitch is still approving the hands one. I don't know if that's a good sign or not. I... <laughs> Takes them a while. Because you want that on Twitch. Of course you do. Which way are we going? You said it was this way. It's not that way. Guy with the big blue sword. I... Oh, right! Yeah, 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 yeah. It's up here, right? Yeah, the, that's, that's what I was thinking of. The the way I went before with, like, some guy who was caged or something. Yeah, up here. Yeah, yeah. This is it. Of course you want that. You know you want it. Unfortunately, though, because of the way Twitch does things... Um... I can only have one emote that is for the regular subscription tier. Everything else, you have to, like... Uh, you have to- oh yeah, this guy. Yeah, yeah, You have to set it for something higher, so like the- like the Chad one is like the 25. And the Todd Howard is a $10 one. And the hands one I'm using for the 5, because I think that's the only one that people like really want. It's just taking so long to get approved. You actually missed this for a long time. You blame it on shitty level design. Make a better Twitch TV or whatever that 
stands for. I think that's what it is. Oh shit. Emote. Yeah, I, I forgot about that. I'll look into it. I think every channel can have four, maybe less if you're small. On uh, better Twitch TV or whatever it's called. I think that's yeah, I think that's it. This guy's have a giant ball sack? What is this? What kind of design is this? Oh yeah, here it is. Oh, nice. Okay. Well it's a good thing we had two of these. That could have been bad. Yeah, you can have four on better Twitch TV. Oh, interesting. Okay. Well, sweet. Uh, hey, lady. Should I kill you? Probably not. Don't look like you're coughing. You m mind coughing to me? Is this telepathic coughing? Also telepathic communication. Mm. Oh, just hurry up, please. Oh, pyromancy. Oh, I see. <sighs> Clothes are in tow. Do you have any clothing you could spare? Really? Wait, so you can give her equipment and... Okay, it's interesting. How did you not know this? No, I don't know. Oh, horses can die. You're talking about something else. I see. Nah, I don't care about you. Don't you hate it when in Skyrim your horse kills a dragon but gets killed by a bandit? I didn't know horses can die either. Wait, what? Really? I thought they were like invincible. That's why they could kill a dragon. Don't help, lady. No, you're fine. Don't worry about this. I got this. It's not like this is, you know, a problem or anything. No, it's fine. Don't worry about that guy either. Don't even warn me or anything. No, you're good. Just sit there and look not pretty. Thanks. Thank you. You're a real help. Hmm. Bitch will sell you pyromancy. Yeah, okay. Your horse only ever died to fall damage. I can give her clothing. Yeah, but why? Is it just like... Like a waifu fag sort of thing? Is there like a reason? Just a... Just a interesting way to get rid of stuff in your inventory, but who would even do that because there's no limit to your inventory so I, I don't get it that's what I'm saying oh nice bonfire cool not even that far from the last one but I guess hey saved us some time and free souls from this guy I suppose <sighs> shit Gotta actually do the jump. Actually need to line it up as well. Fuck me. Platforming and non-platforming games is not exactly my strong suit. I don't think it's anyone's strong suit, but there we go. Admit it- ad Oh, fuck, stop reading the chat. Admit it, weeb man, you don't want to give her clothing because you want to wear the women's clothing you have yourself. Do I have women's clothing? Don't close that. I want to read this. Phantom ahead. Oh, okay. You mean like one of those fake invasions? It's be interesting. Ah, shit. I open these before I look at what's in them. Ooh, whoa. Strong man here. What the fuck? Is that an anvil on a chain? That's pretty sweet. Can I get an anvil on a chain as a weapon? What did I pick up from him? I picked up something. Like something other than... Ooh, 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 st don't fucking spook me like that. Naked woman. I don't know what it was. Something. Something about... Uh, something something I should pay more attention. You can't even make a good-looking waifu in Dark Souls 2 because all the characters have the body posture like Chloe Montez. 
and being a vampire sucks. It does. Yeah, I fucking hate it in Skyrim. It's not worth doing. I did it in Oblivion. I don't, I don't know. It was just kind of neat, but it still kind of sucked, I think. I know they added new stuff, though. They added, uh... What was it? They added that new DLC that adds new stuff for that. Be wary of head. No, oh, okay. But I never really tried that out. Did this guy just leave? Hmm? Oh. Okay. Ah! What a miss! Stood there for a second. It ran out of stamina. There we go. It's just the objectively worst version of being a werewolf. Yeah? Be wary of message. Oh, fuck this. Is this... Hooray for toxic? What did you die from? The guys back there? Nice twin blades, asshole. Be wary of message and then message. Be wary of... Me oh my... Jokes, everybody. Shaded Woods. Okay, yeah, new place. Wow, this just keeps going. A fading soul. Also, rusted coin. Temporarily boosts luck. Is luck a real stat in this game? Fade, fading soul? Fading soul. Used to acquire souls. Well, if it's fading, I guess I should use it now, right? 50. Oh, it's just shit. I see. You remember playing Dark Souls 2 for 32 hours. How long have I been playing in total? I don't know. It says it when you start the game, I think. I think like 12 hours or something? Maybe more? I don't think much more. Yeah, I'd have to look. I don't know. I think Dalton just got back. It was at his girlfriend's house. And he says he's not a normal fag. <laughs> I know you can't. I'm making fun of you. Yeah, I don't know. We've been playing this game for a while. Be wary of projectile and bol boulder. Does it not activate until you use it? Because that's, that's bullshit. Nothing happens. Have I been fooled? What? I don't understand this. Why do people leave these messages? You, it takes time out of your day. You've been playing Dark Souls 2 for exactly 20 hours. Is that right? That's interesting. How do you know that? Oh, do you look on my... Do you know what my Steam account is? Possible. I mean, the name of it is just Yeoman, so I guess it's not too hard to find, but... Hmm. You looked up my Steam profile. Oh, yeah, well. How'd you get to that? Of course you do. How'd you figure, how'd you figure that out? I... Yeah. I'm not... I mean, I'm okay with it. It's not like you're gonna find out anything... At all, <laughs> you know. There's a reason I named it Yeoman. I expect some people to eventually find it. If if I found out some sort of way to actually use it for anything, but... Ooh, ooh, okay. Let's look around a little bit. Don't fall off. Whoa. Alright, we'll go here later. Like you're... It's named Yeoman, like your Twitch, not that hard. You wrote a woo on it. Oh, that's right. No, I saw that a day or, like, a couple days ago. No, you're right. Yep, I knew that, I guess. Mm. This is kind of interesting. There's actually three branching paths from this, from this place. They're probably not going to be very long, but... Huh. Oh, yeah, this one seems like it might be over already. Oh, that is not much damage at all. 
Oh shit, this guy's got a lot of health. He's very easy to predict though. Like shit, <laughs> that is not a hard thing to dodge. Can you just keep doing the exact same attack over and over? Because this will be sweet. Well, that's not exactly the same. Yeah, there's more of this. More of the easiest big enemy I've seen in my life. Ah, shit. Of course I say something like that and I'm gonna jinx it and I'm gonna die from it. It's inevitable. I'm also backed up quite a bit here. Oh, but he won't go any further. Well, that's fine. What? You stuck, big boy? No. Nope. Just, just waiting to sit down at the opportune time. Ah, fuck! That was close. Okay. Alright, cool. Do you know that if you support Vati Video on Patreon, you get his obscure anime night? When you watch obscure anime together over the internet. I did not know that. Do you do that? Because that sounds sad as hell. That sounds like a like a depressing time. That sounds... Also strange? Who pays people to hang out with them? I mean, that's basically what it is, right? It's like, give me $20 and I'll pretend to be your friend online. Shit, I'll do that for free. <laughs> like, what's the point? I don't understand. A tear stone ring. Alright. I forget what that does. That's not the fire deflect one, is it? That's a different one. Boost attack when HP is low. No, oh, my health is often low. I need to get rid of some weight. That's a heavy fucking ring. What else could we get? Poise, nah. HP, more souls. Oh yeah, we should definitely have that. These are pretty light. We'll take this. If you pay me, I'll watch anime with you. Yeah, yeah. If you go to Aust Austria, want to hang out. Dude, I would, yes. That's uh, like, that sounds like a good time. Would you, would I, could I also hang out? I don't know if I'll ever be able to go to Austria, but... What else are you supposed to do when your entire channel consists of fan fiction stolen from... Vedit? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I mean, fair. Oh, you got no health at all, buddy! You're fucking gone. There you go. Bye bye. Are you supposed to be like intimidating or something? That's easy. Produce the symbol of the king. I don't think I have one of those. I don't think I have that. I guess this is not the right way. Is this the thing that's like, uh. This place again? <laughs> is that the thing that's like Dark Souls 1? Where, uh. You just come back there later after some. some big event has happened? What is Vati going to do now anyways? Talk about Souls-like Metroidvania games? That's a good question. I mean, he's still... Doesn't he still... You need King's Ring for that. Doesn't he still put out shit? It's just more Dark Souls stuff? I mean, I guess Dark Souls 3 didn't come out that long ago, so maybe that's what he's still doing, but... I don't know. Maybe he's just making shit up. And he'll just keep making shit up about Dark Souls forever. We'll see why not. Dark Souls doesn't have to be new to keep making shit up about it. If it loses popularity, I guess he's fucked, though. Yeah, like, what else would he do? Oop, out of stamina. But he's just gonna stand there and take it, like... Like a good... a good enemy. I was about to say good boy, but I've realized that, like... Certain mannerisms, certain... certain parts of speech, certain words... You start saying them, 
And you can't stop saying them. So I don't want boy to become one of those kind of words that I'm using every other sentence. I don't care about some things as much. I think I've lowered my usage of fucking enough where I'm not so ups I'm not too worried about it. Doing that that one time sort of helped me a bit. I still use it a lot, but I think it's better. But uh, yeah, I don't want boy to become one of those words. Take it, college boy. <laughs> Twinkling tight night, large soul of a proud night. Nice, nice. The misty path is kind of cool. Well, I mean, I figured this way would end pretty soon. Which is why I was taking this way first. I guess maybe not. I only clicked on one of those blood stains, not all of them. Unless they were playing co op or something. What are these guys dying from? What am I missing? This? This guy? You died from this guy? You kidding? One archer over there. Oh wait! That's a fake phantom! What? That can happen? That's not someone who invaded me, right? That's just like a fake enemy? It's like an invisible enemy? I mean invisible, quote unquote. He, ha he made an 11 minute video about the 5 second teaser FromSoft showed at the Game Awards. Oh well yeah, he seems desperate then. Uh, you know, I mean, that's... Oh, right, yeah, this guy. I mean, that's why you, you don't want to set your channel up to just... I mean, I mean, I guess if you, if you don't care, you don't care. But if you if you want a YouTube channel to last and, like, people keep watching it, don't set it up to be about one fucking thing that's going to go away eventually. Right? Coming from the guy who plays a lot of CK2, this, you know... You can tell I know what I'm talking about, but... Eh, it's not like the channel's big enough to, for that to be the case. You know, like, like have a little bit of foresight. For, forethought. Foresight. The fake phantoms are one of the very few things you like about Dark Souls 2. Yeah, it's kind of neat. I'll, I'll admit. Where's this axe I just got? Unlikely we're going to switch at this point. Dragon Slayer's Crescent Axe. Oh, it's tiny. That's like not even a weapon. Fuck that. Great sword all the way. More message ahead. Oh my god. Why did they do this? Shrine of Winter. Money bags required ahead. Seek mightier souls. You need a certain amount of souls to get in? Bloody expensive. That's a strange mechanic. Strange design decision. That is where it is. Yeah, but your channel isn't named Weeb Man Plays Crusader Kings. Oh, fair. Need 100k souls or all the Lord souls. What if you sell some of them? Like, you gotta have them on you? Because I, didn't I use up one of these? Well, maybe not. No, maybe not. Maybe I didn't. Is the Royal Rat Vanguard sold used for anything good? We should probably use up some of these. In fact, maybe it might be a good time to go do that. Level up a little bit more. I mean, we're getting some good levels in. Uh, yeah, our agility's 107. I think the hard cap is like at 10, 110 or something. I don't really remember. Yeoman, turn around. Okay. All right. Want to show me something? Okay. With the uh, chat delay, the the latency that Twitch has, this might be an interesting. An interesting thing to try to do, but you can't use up the Lord Souls. Oh, oh! I guess I never even tried. Are you sure? Aren't these the Lord Souls? It sure looks like I can use them. Maybe it won't let me if I clicked it. Look at the rubble under the arch. Oh, you talking about that? How do I? Oh no, huh? How do I get over there? Wait a minute. Is there a way around? That's what's keeping you from progressing in the game. Oh! Oh, when you go through here, you come- you can come around from the other side. That's what you need the Shrine of Winter for. Are you serious? This? 
I can't just climb over? I mean, let's be real, I could jump over most of that. That's st fucking stupid. I- just- just climb over it. A child could climb over that. I'm happy you showed me that. That's really bad. You need the souls of four most powerful beings in the Dark Souls 2 universe to overcome a pile of rubble. It's a good game. This is what you're telling me. It's a, it's a good game. This is another point where you just kind of look at it and like, were they? I guess they were just being lazy, right? I mean, this just kind of confirms what we already knew. These these were some lazy developers. They were like, okay, we need to, uh, we can't have him go into this area yet, but we want it kind of open to where you can see he needs to go there later. Okay, what do we, uh, what do we have to, let's put something in front of it so he just doesn't go there. Uh, but that's a lot of work. Why don't we just throw some, like, rubble in front of it to call it a day? Eh, good idea. Um, oh, this is kind of interesting. Especially how, like, this, the camera zooms in, you can't see shit. Oh, hey. Oh, that's just a face. Oh! 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 This is- I like this one so far. Dark Souls 2 is a good game and everyone knows it. That's why so many people are watching this stream, Lou. Yeah. Yep, that's it. I kind of like this a little bit. <laughs> Dark Souls 2 to Uwu. This is actually fairly neat. Now, if you look at it in the same lens of them being lazy, you start to think that, like, maybe they just did this so that they could make a small area. They put the mist on it so that you can't tell it's so small. Still, it's, it looks nice. I like it. Leave me be. I like it quiet. Leave huh. me be. Uh, I can't do that. Business. You may call me Vengal. It is rare to flap these gums. Long ago, I was hired to defend the kingdom. This is a good area, but the area that comes after, that's an experience. Good way, bad way. Okay, all right, I got it. I know not what brings you may bear great bird, but I want to walk. I see visions. My, my body wielding my sword. A oh. Forged. My body will show no mercy. Okay. I learn new things. Every, ah, thanks to you. I recall the joy of conversation. This guy's interesting. I can help you. Oh, he sells the greatsword and a claymore. Ooh. Claymore is basically the same as... Oh, it's just a regular greatsword. I'm not even interested. Eh. Destructive great arrow. Inflicting break damage. Alright. Lightning urn. And lightning and gold pine resin. That seems kind of actually a little useful. But I'm going to grab a couple of those. And why not grab a few of these? Yeah, we'll probably never use them, but if we do. Did he have something else I could do? Learn gesture. Decapitate. Uh -huh. I was a hire. Okay, whatever. That's fine. Have I gone to the earthen tower yet? No. Yeah, I haven't. Here, wait, before I go back into the was that a real phantom or a fake phantom? That was a real phantom. Uh, it's an okay area gameplay-wise, but the graphics, uh, you never, you just got bored. You think this game is wonderful? Sounds like you don't play enough old games. <laughs> uh, you could fight the dude's body, by the way. Yeah, that's what it sounded like, like we'll see him later. Hole ahead. Excuse me? Is this like some sort of glitch area? Oh, oh. Oh, there's just a hole there. Oh, it's just bad level design. I see. Or bad, uh, not really level design, but bad... Not assets either. Just, just... Bad game. <laughs> just holes. That's fine. Hmm. I feel like I'm gonna be missing a lot in this place. Oh, we made it through. Alright. Hey.
What is that? I don't know what it. Freezes on XD. Great. Thanks. Thanks for the meme. Uh, I don't know if it's if it's a good uh, what what it means about me that my first thought is to kill this fucker. But look, he had a good item on him. Well, he had an item on him. We'll find out if it's good. Video games are clearly making me a monster. I killed that innocent butterfly. Or moth, or whatever it was. Oh, nice bonfire. I don't want to use that. That'll probably get rid of that item. It means you're closeted gay. Is that what it means? Haven't done enough personality tests. Uh, this is a real man. God, you fucker. Almost got me. You would have got me. Well, I suppose that you shouldn't have, because you were just standing there. Quite unlike a real person. Is that laughing? Oh, fuck this place. <laughs> oh, it's some sort of like... Hmm, bird or something. Uh, it sounds like laughing. But it sounds like almost like a like a lighter kookaburra. So it might just be that. Or kookaburra. Like not so grating as a kookaburra. Cool. Now how do I uh how do I exit? I would like to Oh, oh it's right here. No, that's where I came in. I'd like to go right there. It looks like we gotta jump. Okay. Either that or we gotta go around. I hope it's jump, because I'm about to jump. I hope we're supposed to jump. Although it looks like there's not even a good place to jump. Well... Well, actually... Yep, we're good. To a flip, faggot. Twilight herb. Uh, so it wasn't even like something amazing, it's just a... a consumable. Twilight Herb. Restore spell use. Ah, oh, fucking worthless. Alright. Oh. Oh, hey. You might be a little tougher in tight situation. Maybe. Maybe not. I know you're gonna put up too much of a fight. No, you're actually blocking, though. That's an improvement. Blocking like, yeah, usually I could... Ooh, ooh, you got me. You hit me. You drew blood first. Well, not first. You drew blood. Good on ya. Yeah, come at me. <laughs> well, that didn't work quite right. Hey, there it is. I mean to slap him with the sword. And there we go. Cool. We lifting in the morn. Uh, yes. Is it late? Nah, I can... I'll probably be wrapping it up soon. But yes. Yes, we are. Absolutely. Gotta lift. You can't skip lifting. Very important. Also, I've noticed this. It's kind of hard to... You might even be able to tell. Sometimes I try to lean back while I'm playing, and the the audio usually gets worse, so I try not to do it. I don't have a I don't have one of those things. Great. Oh, we could have just came from down here. Oh, okay. But uh, it makes my back start to hurt a little bit. Luckily, lifting fixes it. So like, I definitely have to lift after a long long night of streaming. Black Knight halberd. Sounds like a big weapon. Maybe. Uh, I don't think it's for me. Uh, what's the damage like? Unupgraded, we have to remember. 213! That's actually pretty fucking good, isn't it? We don't have enough dexterity to actually use it, though. Right? If I equip it real quick, will it tell me that? Yeah. So even if we wanted to, not really a choice. And it doesn't have quite the same, the same feeling 
as just a big fucking sword does. It's a good thing I looked down first. Could have fucked that up. Yeah, let's get back to the bonfire. Another one of those things of yore? Like another one of those statues? Why would you do that one? It doesn't even block anything. What kind of games does Dalton like? Old 3D platformers, city builders, and fun FPSs. Play a Hat in Time and Deus Ex 1. Those are some good rec- Well, I haven't played Hat in Time, but anybody who, who recommends Deus Ex, that's a good game. Although, I mean, I guess I can't really say that anyone who recommends it has good taste, because, I mean, it's, it's become somewhat popular. You know, someone can recommend it and not even play it, but that's a good game. I gotta replay that. That's something I played as a kid that I, I haven't replayed ever. Definitely be worth a go through. Did I just get cursed? What the fuck's over here? What are you doing? Why? There's a curse over there and everybody's laughing at me. That's definitely laughing. Yeah. You really shouldn't skip lifting. Once you skip lifting, you start to skip it more and more. Yeah. Then you end up dropping it completely. Yep. It's momentum. Oh yeah, curse. Okay, well not that way then. Is it had in time actu an actually good new 3D platformer? Yes it is, there's just not enough of it. Hmm. Great movement system, well that's important. That's what made Super Mario 64 good. Which is just fucking moving around felt cool. That's not exactly what I meant to do, but I guess I'm okay. There's a curse. What's a curse? Oh shit. Stop, stop, stop. Okay, don't go in there. What was that in there though? That looked pretty... Hmm. Let me let this curse drain a little bit, then maybe a little, let me take a peek. Is that a wheelchair? Oh, that is a wheelchair. Ah, shit. What does curse do? Oh, fuck. It doesn't lower your health, does it? I thought that's what it did. Does it not do it until I die? Actually, I'm going to wrap it up right here. Um, because I've got to take a piss. <laughs> Dave Sex and a Hat in Time are great suggestions. Oh, yeah, yeah. Never, you never played FTL? It's definitely worth a play. Well, I mean, it's cheap. You could get it for probably like 250 I think Good Old Games is having a sale right now. It's probably there. And uh, it's good. It's a good little it's a good little game. Decently challenging. I like it. Uh, Yeah. Yeah, I think I'm good. I think we're going to call it there so I have enough time to get some rest before working out. Yeah, this is actually right about when I need to be going to bed. When are we going to stream something? Um, I'll have to... We'll have to... I'll have to figure that out. Maybe soon. I don't know. I don't know what I'm streaming tomorrow. It's probably Hand of Fate. Shill yourself to a office. There's, I, I don't know what you mean by that. <laughs> There's nothing to shill here. He's already here. But yeah, I'll, uh... I don't know what I'm doing tomorrow, but I'll probably be streaming something. But, uh, I'll see you. Will it be Professor Layton? I don't know. <laughs> Never. Yeah, I, I don't know. We'll see. But yeah, I'll, uh, I'll see it. Bye-bye.